Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video of uh, Pokemon Scarlet and New Violet. I totally butchered that intro, but anyways, we're just gonna keep on going. Last time we took on, you know, the gym leader, and this time we're just gonna go ahead and follow down this route. I'll explore the rest my own time up in here, unless there's like a new Pokemon where I'm just like, ooh, I gotta go capture that bad boy. Unfortunately, dude, all these battles down here are all gonna be low level, so... We'll see if I, like, come up with a squad to go up against, like, these gym leaders and possibly also the Team Star boss find there. I think we're gonna go ahead and do that first, to be honest, and then we'll take on, uh, the gym leader and all that after. This episode will be basically just taking on the Team Star boss of the fire type. We'll see how her hot ride is gonna be like, you know, man, the fire and steel type. Yes, I don't know how they, uh, make it. It's like their own Terra type. I guess Terra Crystal that they be using up in here, man. Also, I'm definitely taking on that other Titan as well. It's gonna be pretty nice. As you can see, my goodness, we can already see it up in here. And why well, you can capture the electric flying type Pokemon if you come out now here. If we went to the east side, it seems like uh, we're meant to go to the east side first. I guess east side with gem battle, the grass type into the time Pokemon, and go to the west side, take on the bug type, come back here and take on the electric gym, and then the water, and then go for the normal type. And then you just go up against uh, all the other guys up in the mountain and stuff after that. Actually, you probably go to the psychic type gym leader after that, probably. This level cap, you know, was like, what, 25 level? And then the bug type was like 15 or whatever and the second gym for the water we took on was uh water type and uh level i think also 25 to be honest man i'm not gonna lie it looks like we can already go ahead and uh, take on this, this uh, fire team grunt up in here already we can also get ourselves a task uh pull on out here you can get a lot of good pokemon if you guys went to the east side hello why didn't we go to the east side west side took a while for us to get any good pokemon on out there where the heck is the entrance is the entrance but it has to be back there right the entrance surely it's not up here well there's their base yeah, I want to go ahead and take on uh, the Team Star boss. I just say I was not going to go ahead and use any. I'm not doing. What level are they going to be, man? Like level 20, probably. Unless these guys actually go up in high levels or whatever, but I don't know. I guess we'll find out here. I love her, Clavel. Or should I say Clay? Hey, Yaro. Hello, Director Clavel. As I've told you, the name's Clay. Please don't forget it. Now let's pick up our conversation from where we left off before. As I mentioned, I joined Operation Starfall to resolve a sticky situation to find out the reasons behind Team Star's odd behavior. Above all, I wanted to know why my students and uh, Team Star have stopped coming to school. And just like Cassiopeia, I want the team to disband for good. Since joining Operation Starfall with you, I've already had some success in opening up a dialogue with Team Star, and I think I'm starting to understand things more clearly. But I don't have enough information just yet. That's why I want to speak with students from Team Star's other squads as well. If you intend to take on another base, know that so you can count on me for backup. Till then, see you around, y'all. Alrighty then, well we can already see the entrance point is just right there and then that is all blocked off. Doesn't want us to go... Where does it not? Go this way and head into Arctazone. Okay. Anyways, let's go up uh, ahead and uh, challenge this team sorry, but I don't know, do these guys also change levels? Because, uh, I feel like they do, but I don't know, we'll see. Whoa, whoa, you can't be here. This base belongs to Team Star. You don't clear out real quick like I'll have to come at you in self-defense, get me? I'm not turning him back, man, come on. Well, alright, time for me to the self-defense that's not in it. Out, or right, out, ya, yeah, whatever, etc. Let's do this. Come on, then. Team Star, a grand challenge by Team Star, a grand challenge. How door? Oh, well. No looks of it. <laughs> oh wait, level 25, okay. Now these guys are actually a little bit better. I about to say, if they were like level 20 or below, I would have probably swapped. Yeah, it's jamming my teammates, you know. This thing might be level 30 to 35. Now, what was the last one? I think the last one was level 30. Crazy strong, are you that kid who declared war? That's right. Whoa, thanks for the terrible news. Excuse me while I book it back to the rest of my crew. Hasta la vista! He shot me. Cassiopeia told me to scope out the fire cruise base. I thought you didn't like Cassiopeia. I thought I'd come give you some backup now that I'm through. But seems you're all set. Oof. Aw. Oh. Charcadet! Can we actually capture this thing here? This would have been way easier. Bro. Is that you? Charlos? Charlos? I thought so. What are you doing here? You know this little fella? It's Charlos the Charcadet. 
He's one of the Pokemon on the, on the Academy takes on Karen within his grounds. Oh. Ah! Charles! Wait! He ran off! Looks like he may have some connection to Team Star's fighting crew. I'd better chase after him. Don't worry, I'll regroup with you soon enough. You press ahead into the base, YOLO. Alrighty, Director Clavel. I'm oh, gonna sell zero time. Yeah, dude, that black skin is nice. I see you dealt with the grant standing guard. Nice work. Man, you're watching from afar. Station inside that base is Team Star Fighters crew and a Shatter Squad. Their boss, Mela, is the best all-rounder on the team. She fixes any and every problem thrown her way, though her methods are heavy-handed. Our declaration of war must have made her boil and boil. I bet even now her grunts are hard at work inside the base trying to keep her furry under control. That means your best move is to take down all of the grunts nice and quick. Once there's no one allowed to help Mela keep her cool, she should come out to confront you. Ring the bell, bell on the gates so once you're ready so to kick off this phase of the operation. Time to wipe the Shatter Squad off the map. Alrighty then. Guess you'll pay him. Let's shout on! Right then, seems star, but shall we? I thought we were gonna go for the Shark Cadet, man. Seems the hacks behind Operation Starfall Fool are finally making a move against our base. You know what that is, gang. Thanks for us to try and break and revenge our teammates. And then we're doing training. Just so you know. If you got the skills to defeat 30 of our Pokemon and 10 minutes or boss, my deem you were to meet in person. Ha! <laughs> break a leg! Hey man, we'll see. I defeat 30. Target deck, can I catch you guys? <laughs> no? Alright then. Well, 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 Scott Villain, go! Ba bum 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 What a work going against every mod that we encounter. Gonna keep on following this. Got some hounders, got some Torco. You guys are actually a bit more challenging for the Torco gang, at least. Go get him, Scott Villain! Go, 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 go! You guys got this, man. You all gonna win 100%. Go! Mabble stiff. Skull villain. You gonna watch my call? Armor Use that sign shock, man. Yeah, let's go. Come on, man. We're just close. It's only been a minute. So come on, let's go. Gotta check them all on. Easy dumbs approaching up in here, brothers. Alright, go up against them, go up against them. And I send you guys on out here, man. GG! Our defenses are breached, it's all up to the boss now! Boss of Team Star's fire crew, Mella. Come on. Looking hot on out here, man. So you're the dope who picked a fight with Team Star. I don't know why you do something so stupid and I don't care. You challenged us, so we'll beat you down. That's all there is to it. Prepare to get messed up. Alright then, Mella, let's see. What you got? Kind to be honest. A level 25 ain't gonna do nothing. Quick ball, oh my. Did they all, did all the Team Star bosses have different types of Pokeballs? Did not know that anyway. Sorko! Maboshte! Right here, right now, you're going down! Alrighty then. I'll see, man. Drought. No, Sorko, you are the slowest man of all time, so peace out, man. Crunch! Ah, defensive, eh? Overheat! This move you'll torch you till there ain't nothing but ash left. Oh, I will. Is it? Okay. And that was for the rest of the Shatter Squad. I don't know if I'm saying that right, by the way. He's going with the flow. <laughs> oh, man. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I don't know. You guys can roast me in the comments. Not literally. Anyways, River Room is next. I ain't burned to the crispy just yet. Oh, you're okay. You're already setting this bad boy yet. I see you fire to level 26. Yeah. Uh, would you be faster? Nah, sure. Oh, no. 
I'm oh, gonna use green stone on green. Defense harshly fell. Yeah, dang. Trying to get rid of me that easily up in here. And your defense is also drop. Why not see a more convenient for me because now I can use uh, this bad boy. Blazing torque. Come you punch. Speed boost. Okay, every time you get hit, you're the same thing as the freaking as a wug trio, man. Like, come on, man. Blazing Thor. Marble stiff, no! <sighs> I can't believe you actually got one of my Pokemon. Scarville, and I choose you! Ah. Every time shouldn't do much, it's just gonna be neutral and all this. You know, anyways, what's the best one that we got up here? Crunch! Screeching, lower my defense. That is actually bad, because Scarville is not a defensive mind, bro. Definitely will be one shot of burn, but GG! Oh, well, uh, at least it took out one of my mons. Dang it. Scar villain. Now that was spicy. Uh, is this really how it's gonna end? What a hassle. About a year and a half ago, another backstory. Man, what a hassle. Pull it off just in time. Welcome back, Melly. Now I managed to get a bunch of Char Cadets we evolved. That ought to be enough to power the Star Mobile and finally get that hunk of metal rolling. Glad tidings indeed. Is it not so, Ortega? I'm just surprised she's not all hot there. Oh, shut it. With the snide comments, you can be such an annoying twerp, you know? As if you're any better, Mella. Being rude and saying mean things is literally your whole ideal. That's not true, Orny. The girls at the academy have always been jealous of how cute Melly is. She just puts on a shirty attitude, so they'll stop picking on her. Although, I guess you're not wrong to say that her shirty attitude is what people know her for. What? Come on, not you too, Erie. How about we leave it at that, folks? It's almost time for the big event. Yes, your Operation Star is finally happening. And the big boss, what prank is their plan? They already got it in touch with all the boys and asked them to head over to the schoolyard. It's finally time, huh? Man, I'm so stoked. The throat's burning me right up. I burned through everything I had, and now I've sputtered out. Yes, this is where it ends. That maple stuff of yours really let us have it. Being me. <laughs> the way she walks, bro. Being me in battle is a huge deal. So here, take this star badge and be proud of yourself. Oh, there are some big dudes. And definitely not bend with those things, bro. I <laughs> know, when you're just walking like, uh, Hello? You're burning me, you're hurting me, Oh, I was saying, is she that strong? Okay. Well, I'm out, you can have to see him too. Not like I'm gonna use it. Flame charge, boost your speed. Let me make one thing clear. I'm not giving these to you. I'm giving them to your maples too. I don't think, can I learn this? You got what you came for, now leave me alone. Near Milo from Team Star Rain. Right? There is a Pokemon I'd like to use to see. Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Charcadet. Hi, hey, Charcadet, wait. Well, if it ain't Charles, what are you doing here? Seems who he came to this place looking for you. You did? He's very attached to you, isn't he? Yeah, because I used to play with him every day back when I was still going to school. I can even tell more or less that what he's thinking just by looking at the way his flames move. Do you have any idea why Charles wanting to visit you? Charles. To me, it looks like he's saying that he wants you to come back. Just shut it already, would you? They say Team Star has holed itself up in these bases to plot something against the Academy. Were you aware of this? First, I've heard of a stupid rumor like that. Man, nothing's changed since back then. Everyone's still spelling them garbage. Then, what about that modified car you were motoring around in just now? The Star Mobile, we made that thing a long time ago to help us out with the big fight. But we never actually used it against anyone before you two came looking for trouble. Never used it before. And what's this about a big fight? You ever heard of Operation Star? Operation Star. No, Operation Star Fall? No, this is the first I'm hearing of it. Huh. Yeah, I guess you wouldn't know. 
But for me and the rest of the team star, his same memory will always treasure. Operation Stomp. Now, oh, GG's. Yellow, it is me. Oh, the star badge is now yours, and. Indeed, brother. I see. Now that there's no boss to lead him, the rest of the Cheddar Squad shouldn't last long. No, Mela, too. Sorry, I've got a lot on my mind right now. So, I'm ready to start while you tell you know and all about you, Mesa, so it's fair to say it's going well. This seems like a good time to let you know what we're ultimately aiming to achieve. Our vital goal is to defeat the mastermind that first recruited the five squad bosses and create a team star. The only one they call the Big Boost. This person, like. Who knows? They control the five squad bosses from the shadows. That's all anyone can say. If we defeat this person and get them to declare the team disbanded, that'll be a for Team Star. Since the big boss never set up their own base and keeps their identity hidden, I say get their no one for the spotlight. But once all the squad bosses are out of action, the big boss will finally have to take the stage. Now about your reward, I'll transfer some LP over to your phone as promised. Oh, right, thank you, Cassiopeia. And some more teams. Yep. My sublime unit rep will be there soon. Uh, hey there, Yolo. That uh, sounded like a pretty serious phone call. What's up then, Benny? Oh, and guess who's down again? Ah, I wasn't talking to you. Not again. Ah! <laughs> oh, man. My name Garina. Why do you I don't like her so much, eh? So, that must be you were talking about. Cassiopeia has mentioned them to me, too. Team Star's founder, the person who's caused all kinds of misery at the Academy. If you don't take them down, I'll lose what I treasure most in the world. You lose your treasure? Ah, uh, no, I just... Um, that's right. You need your reward. Here, take it before I forget. Matinialis. Well, I'll be off, then. Peace out, Penny. Stay safe out there. Oh, and Yolo? Don't lose to those guys. Aren't you, Benny? We're gonna win this! Alright, easy. GG, Starfall G. Eleven G. Let's see what you guys add up in here. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, is gonna do it for today's episode. We took um, the Fire Team Storm boss, and the next thing that we're gonna go ahead and do. What are we gonna do? We can head on to is a victory round to take on the next gym leader and or go up against Battle Legend. Well, just to be honest, I think I'm gonna do this one first, to be honest with you. Just so that we can finally get Rock Climb, hopefully. Ah, right, surely, man. I mean, this is obviously in the trailer. It's the big old Crap Pokemon that we're gonna go ahead and uh, defeat. I guess that's gonna be a new mod that we can go ahead and capture as well. So, yeah, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.